Okay, this is Nugget, and <clears throat> um, I'm showing you how to do his, uh, well, it's kind of a creative cut, but it's a summer cut for my dog. Um, actually, transition, kind of more spring cut, I guess. He pretty much gets shaved down in the summer. Um, anyway, I've already shown you how to do his body. His uh, face, feet, and sanitary I already did. I already went back over the body. Now that he's clean, he's dry. Um, now what I'm going to do is um, I'm taking a one inch snap on comb over my um, 40 blade and I'm not going to go the whole way down his leg because I'm leaving him kind of like a bell look. So I'm just going to take it down his leg to about right there. As you can see it doesn't take very much off at all. Just neatens him up a little bit. With a snap-on comb, the dog has to be 100% brushed out. You cannot have any mats in the coat or the snap-on comb will not go through the hair, basically. Um, also, you need to go over it a few different times. Um, like you'll see, I'm going to fluff it up here. And then go back over it again. Because it's kind of hard with a, with a snap-on comb to get everything 100% uniform. And you do need to go back over it and scissor over it a little bit when you're done. Now I'm going to go ahead and do the front leg. Same thing, I'm not going all the way down the leg. Just comb back through it real quick. Make sure I got everything. Scooch them over here. Just kind of blend out when you get part of the way. I just try to keep it about even where I cut off from, from the back leg. Now that I've got my clipper work done, um, I'm going to come around here so you can see for one thing. Um, comb back through all this hair. Make triple, quadruple sure that you got all your mats out. Um, I said I wasn't going to trim his paws, but I did end up thinking that I'm going to trim them just a hair. Um, just to get the nasty stuff that sticks out underneath. I'm not doing a real tight bevel. Um, Cause like I said, I'm trying to keep him kind of in a bell. So I'm gonna go close in the back here. You can you can kind of see what I'm doing, and just lightly trim around the edge. I'm not making sure to get every single hair by any means. Just so he's not stepping on a bunch of fuzz when he puts his foot down. So you can see I did not trim very much off of that at all. Then I'm just gonna barely go around the bottom. Alright, now I'm going to comb everything up or out rather, straight out from the leg. Kind of let it do its own natural thing. And then I'm gonna take my scissors and scissor down the direction the coat would normally lay. Tidy things up a little bit here and there. Anything I might have missed. I am using curved shears because I'm giving him a rounded look to his groom. I pretty much use curved shears for everything. But it's just a preference, really. Personal thing. Alright, now we're going to do this front leg. Same way, basically. It's just shaped a little differently than the back leg, obviously. Okay. Just neaten just a hair around the 
underneath of the paw, just like I did on the other one. Nothing major. Just to try and keep the bottom clean a little bit. And up. Comb everything down and out. Try to get your dog to stand still. Always helps. Okay. Neaten up underneath real quick. When everything to lay real smooth. Again, you want your dog to stand up. Nugget knows this, but he's where at, aren't you? side of his leg here. I'm going to kind of hold it up here and just scissor the inside of the leg. Now let's try to there. Um, all I have left to do is his ear over here, which you can see I've already done this one. Um, you want to run a comb through it, make sure it's nice and combed down, no mats or tangles. And this is pretty much, you can do this on any dog with, with long ears. And you just comb it down, hold still, hold still. Hold the ear out, take your scissors, and start trimming back and round. And you want to try and hold their heads up straight and look. And you can see that this one's a little longer. So we hold it out, trim it a little bit more. Hold still. And it's still a little too long. Well, I usually do them right at the same time as you can kind of get a feel for how long you did the other one. Basically, there is my nugget in his very, very, very cute summer cut I call legs. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Bye.